So we decided to scout the track with the ATVs. From this point on, there is no turnaround points for the large boat. So if we drive in, there is no going back. Not so bad so far. We might be able to get through here after all. But then we get to this. You wait there, Simon. I'll go first, eh? Geez, this one looks a bit deep. Oh, I don't think I want to go through there. He's going to get a wet ass. Yeah, he's getting a wet ass. Yuck. Ah, that's a bit deep, mate. You ain't getting through there, Simon. No way. Nah, no, I'm not going through there. I reckon the quad bike would drown in there. Maybe there's a side track. Just have a look. You might be able to take that one, eh? Yeah, I'll go and have a good hit. I reckon I'll get through this first bit, just not that last bit. Get a bit of traction. I think you're stuck. That's it. We're never going to get a vehicle through there. That's just like soup. It ain't happening, eh? Like that, look, that, that's fine there, but if you we cut off into this swamp area, yeah, it just ain't going to happen. You've got to stay on this hard pack stuff. Is this the deep one? Nah. Oh, hell no. There's normally no water here. This is normally a little bit wet. There's normally no water here. <laughs> <laughs> so there's normally no water here. Nah. Like you say, we'd probably get the cars to here. Yeah. But we got to get to the beach. Yeah, we got to get to the beach. All right, let's go, keep go going, mate. Oh, a bit more, a bit more. We decide to push on anyway, and sure enough, the next crossing looks even deeper. Is this it, mate? Is this the one? This is it, bud. So this looks like the go, eh? So this is the deep one that went over the bonnet of the old patrol. That's her? Yeah. Looks like it's up a bit, too. All right, well, the only way we're going to test it is if we walk it. There could be crocs in there, mate. Was it you that was telling me that local blokes that go pigging around here? Yep, they reckon every water hole in these sand dunes, there's a resident croc living there. It doesn't even look like croc country. No, it doesn't. That's what they said to me. Oh, I've heard it a couple of times now over the years. Oh, I hate that. Well, you know what we're going to have to do, don't you? Let you go 50, first. 50 chance. No, no. 50 <laughs> 50 chance, mate. We're getting close to the coast, too. It's only just over that hill there. Go and get a stick. Make sure you clips off your knife. And I'll push you in front. Thanks, mate. Come on, let's go. <laughs> no, that's deep. Oh, mate, 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 I don't know about that. Yeah, it gets a bit shallow up there. That's like, just like a big hole, isn't it? Yeah, man. Forget it. Look, it's not, it's not just the water. Quietly, it's not just the water, it's the, it's the trees. I reckon we'll spend half a day just trimming that first section, just trying to get that big boat through. It's so high, it's painful. Hey, Jase, you're not really going to leave without trying to get that buggy through here, are you? Yeah, look, come on, mate, we've got to give her a go. You've got to give it a whirl. Yeah, come on. Come on. Oi, you got to sit in with me. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> All right, okay. we jump snorkel. in, mate. we got a snorkel. If was a bit of fun in the buggy, it would drown the trucks. We both know what this means. Until this track has dried out, there is no way we get the Cape Flattery.